Welcome back to my channel. This is Moy Garcia from Moy Garcia Rebinds, and I have here another Bible for review sent by Crossway, and uh, we're thankful for them to collaborate with our channel so that we can do these videos for you. And in this case, we have here a very, very uh, interesting edition of the English Standard Version Bible with creeds and confessions in the gold skin black color it comes with this amazing box very sturdy and with a lovely design as you can see here it has all the logo from Lock crossway and uh, the, the english in the version called skin black and this is indeed the esv bible with creeds and confessions and we'll look at them now in a minute so both sides are the same and in the back we have some details I want to just stop there for a, for a second in case you want to take a look at it so these are the creeds and confessions that we have in the back of the Bible the Apostles Creed the Nicene Creed Athanasian Chalcedonian Augsburg Belgi Belgic Articles of Religion Canons of Dort Westminster London Baptist, Heidelberg, and Westminster Large and Shorter Catechism. Now the Bible itself comes in a 10-point lexicon type uh, with introductions to each of the 13 creeds and confessions. Uh, the binding is Smithson, two ribbon markers, double column format, and it comes with lifetime guarantee, uh, which is great. That's from Crossway, ASV.org. Okay, so here's the Bible itself. Let's take a look at it. And as you can see here, this is a very, very grainy, yet soft goatskin leather. I, I am very pleased with this leather, it's very nice. The actual spine comes with uh, Holy Bible stamped in gold with creeds and confessions, and it's more font right there, the ESB. English Standard Version and Crossways logo, and it comes with one, two, three, four, and five raised hubs on the spine. You can see it right there. Well defined and pronounced. Now the the cover comes with stitching around the perimeter, as you can see, and this cover is very soft. It's very uh, flexible. You can roll that up. Now, 
the inner liner is also very soft and smooth it's black it has a kind of velvety feeling to it and uh, it does come with the gold gilt line around the perimeter too and obviously this is lined tapped into the text block right there uh, the corner work in this Bible as the previous Bible that I reviewed I'm not so much concerned how good or how well plated they are uh, some people get mad at me because I mention corners but when the actual corner is cut off going through as you can see there again the liner then that's a concern it looks like they cut this after it's being glued to the liner and then they trim it and they cut through there you go see that cut through the liner they actually per, uh, cut the liner that's happened also in this corner see that cut through the liner that shouldn't be done that way they I'm gonna have to uh, mention this to Crossway because they never done this this way and I believe this is someone that doesn't know exactly how to do this and they are look at this one it's chopped off right there look at this and then the liner is also cut so for a Bible supposed to be a premium Bible like this having that type of finishing which is in my in my view uh, it's not the way it's supposed to be. That's not how you do it. You don't you don't cut the liner in order to trim a corner. That's not how you do it. Uh, I will just uh, email Crossway. Maybe they're not aware of this and uh, let them know that this is happening with their Bibles. Because uh, definitely this is not Crossway standard. But nevertheless, without that, the cover is very nice I like it it's very nice it's a good quality color besides that now it has you have it comes with a, a very nice end sheet matching the, the actual liner and black this is a very thick glossy cardstock and then we have the presentation page Holy Bible marriages, births and adoptions, that's and this is the Holy Bible East English Standard Version, indeed, by Crossway, Wheaton, Illinois, and then we have the ESV.org website as well. This is the actual 2016 text edition. Um, And it is printed in China, published by Crossway, USA. Now here are the table of contents. As you can see here, we got the Old Testament, the New Testament, and all the different uh, extra uh, information that we are going to find in this edition, like table of weights and measures, concordance, and decrees and confessions. And this Bible comes also with red under gold. In this case, this one comes with uh, slightly mark here and there. It looks like there's some tracking there from some machine, but it's a nice uh, a light red under the gold. I like the gold. It's very nice and bright. And the, the red, as you can see here, is, is a very uh, light, uh, easy in the eye red. Okay. Now, it is a very readable Bible. Here's the preface. Let's go to Genesis. I would like to show you this. The font is very nice. I think you can't go wrong with this typeset. It's very nice. It's in the eye. It's uh, readable. Very well spaced. I, I like it. I, I really like this, this type of font. It's a paragraph format, which means that the numbers for each verse follow the actual line rather than starting a new line but it is line matched uh, this will make a great reader 
and uh, even to teach from it if you don't really bother by it. I, in my case, I prefer verse by verse, but this this setting this setting is great for uh, long periods of reading, and even to follow up some teaching, if you will. Uh, I think this this Bible is excellent for that. The paper is not bad at all. I like it. It's thin, but it's not very thin. Okay, uh, the ghosting is minimal. The show through between uh, pages. So it is not distracting when you're reading. I like it. The print is uh, consistent, it's dark. And if, if you go to the New Testament, I want to show you something. This is black letter. It doesn't have any red letter, which means that the words of Jesus are not going to be highlighted in red. You can see here everything is black. Some people prefer that. And I have to say the the black is very is very consistent. I like it. It's very it's dark enough. It's not very bold. Some people don't like it too bold. But you can see here how nice that is. Then you have the references and cross references and footnotes down the bottom. Now, if you know the ESV, you know that uh, it's a, a very popular translation nowadays. But, and I really like the fact that this one is not too bulky, and uh, but it comes with concordance, three column concordance. And this is the actual special deal that you get with this edition, which is the creeds. Uh, there's an introduction to it, and then you have basically one by one with an introduction and the actual creed itself in in the same typesetting, very large and bold uh, uh, font. It's not like a little font that is all compressed. It's actually meant to be read and uh, I like it. Some of the articles, the Augsburg Confession. Doesn't mean you can, you're gonna agree with everything that is, is here. Uh, in fact, I read through some of them and uh, some parts I agree, other parts I don't <laughs> agree. But it's good to have it as a Let's say I look it up as I look at this as a part of the history of uh, Christianity in the world and how it uh, went developing uh, throughout the ages. So I think this is a very good, nice feature to have at least in one Bible. So well done, Crossway, for doing something like this. I really like it. And we're going to back and we're going to the very end now, nearly finishing. You can see there's plenty of that. I just want to show you how thick this is. So, all these pages are the actual addition of the confessions and creeds. Not bad. Then we got these maps, typical crossway maps, you know, thicker and glossy car stock. And that's indeed gold skin leather. Now let's take out now let's let's take a look at the measurements of this Bible. This Bible is about ten inches tall. by six and a half inches wide and about one inch nearly one inch and a half is a bit less than a one inch and a half 
so that's the measurements for this Bible it comes with two ribbons thin ribbons again they're not great they're just there to be honest that's one of the things that uh, I would like Crossway to upgrade their ribbons but they're there they're easy to be uh, replaced if you don't like them and uh, overall I really like this Bible this edition is nice uh, besides the problem with uh, the, the tracking of the gilding and, and those uh, corners that are chopped off and, and the liners cut through, uh, everything else I really like and I recommend it. So this is all for today my friends. If you like this video please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done so so you can get notifications for uh, next uh, Bible Rebinds or uh, reviews. So I hope to see you soon in my next video, but until then, Shalom.